Double K Beats, Double K Productions, and I am back with you in Priest on the Studio 1-5. Back with another tutorial. This tutorial, I'm going to just go ahead real quick. Somebody requested this, so we're just going to go ahead and fly this hook, okay? So, I showed y'all, I did two tutorials on this. I did one complicated one. I did one that was easy for me, but obviously... That still was complicated for somebody. So, I'm about to just show y'all the quick and easy way to do it. The easy way. There's really no easy way. I know y'all keep saying the easy way, but there's only really one way to do it. It's copy and paste it over and then match it up if you if you, if you don't know how to do it with a bus. Okay, there's two ways, but I'm going to show you my... This way, all right? Uh, I showed you with a bus, how to do it, just make you a bus, and then copy and paste this over. But we're going to copy this. We're going to go ahead and copy that, or we can duplicate it, okay? So we, that's what we're going to do. We're going to duplicate it. It's going to move the whole thing, all right? So just think, we're going to delete it. Just think that you have uh, your uh, vocals going on. So if we didn't have this bus and we just copied these vocals... Be like that, and we we'll just copy these vocals. It'd be the same thing moving it over. So, what you want to do is let's go ahead and solo the beat out. All right, the tempo is one four. Okay, tempo. 140 the B the uh, metronome is going to the BPMs all right so just get your tempo first find your tempo or the beat that is key I know a lot of y'all just get these two tracks y'all pull them in and leave the tempo at 120 well flying that hook is gonna be tough because it's not in the tempo form okay if the beat is 120 then it's gonna work if the beat is not a 120 tempo which is down here Flying that hook is going to be tough to snap the grid, all right? So what you want to do is put on snap the grid, adaptive bars, and quantize at 116, all right? So every time you move, it's snapping snap to grid, all right? So you definitely want to have this on adaptive, adaptive, and snap to grid, all right? I always have it on bars, and right there, 116, all right? Okay. Get that key, find your tempo. Okay, we, we, we on beat, right? We on the metronome, it's on key, on beat. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna duplicate. Just press D on the on the uh, keyboard. So we, we hit delete, we can do the same thing. Oh, I moved it, we done Alt Z, I mean Control Z. A minute. Don't try to put on a uh, little outfit. All right, go. Uh, all we can do it's it's in the bus. All right, so I moved it again. We can hit D. It's gonna duplicate it. Okay. So what we want to do is find where this B drops. So if we listen to this hook real quick, that's what I should have done. Let y'all listen to it. So we hit this, highlight it all, hit duplicate, which would be D on on the uh, keyboard, and we're gonna find the breakdown, which will be after your verse, hopefully. I mean we we'll find the Yeah, the breakdown of the hook coming in, which should be after your verse. Alright, so it should be hitting right there at 57. Boom. Okay, so if we hitting that 57, which we'll put that right there, and we didn't hit duplicate, we hit delete, we boom, copy, put your uh, marker right where it should be hitting, 
which will be at 57. Boom. Right? So we hit Control C, Control V. It puts it right on place. I see you looking at the with me. I get the chop and load them up. Just the hell of a All right, so we delete that. Let me show y'all one more time. We find where the beat drops at. If you have this tempo, your beat should be dropping at every 16, 17. 18 should be another drop. Okay. 19. Boom. Boom. Okay. If you have your tempo, that's how it should be hit. So let's show y'all again. Boom. We have 17. That's where the hook hits. We put this cursor back to where we had it on the second verse, 57. Boom. Right there. 57. Zoom in. Get it right. 57. Zoom in. Get it right. Uh, right there. We do this. Hit that. Highlight all your vocals. Control C, Control V, then play. That's it. Find your tempo of the beat. Don't just pull a two track beat in and uh, record on 120 because your vo your vocals will be off once you find that tempo. So find your tempo first when you pull that two track in. Get that tempo right, put the metronome on to make sure it's right, and then start recording. Once you get done recording, all you have to do is highlight your vocals. Control, Control C, Control V, copy and paste it. All right, so you put your cursor right where you should, right where you want that thing to paste at. So if we delete it again, we hit duplicate over here, we hit Control C. Control V. Boom. We on deck. All right? Let's copy and paste. So if we hit delete and we do duplicate, it'll be the same thing. We're going to do that. Then we're going to drag it over. But now we're going to zoom in. Okay? Zooming in. Right there. Should be snapping the grid, right? So we're going to zoom in. Make sure that's right on the money. Right? I see you looking at the with me. I get the chop and load them up. And that's how you fly a hook. I ain't gonna keep it no more complex than that. That's that simple. Do it, and you'll be flying hooks every time. It'll be easy for you. This is Double K Beats. Hopefully, this tutorial helped you. If you're looking for mixing templates, at doublekbeats.com. Link in the description below. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. If you're looking for beats and you're an artist, doublekbeats.com slash beatstore. All right? Go get yours, man.